Hello, my name is Omar Abbasad. It is February 4, 2019, Monday at 3.52 p.m. in Toronto. So I posted a bunch of tweets uh, today and uh, I talked about the criminal activity of um, remote prostitution, remote sex slavery, and how it's done and how it's covered. So um, right now, um, it's... Um, my, uh, my name is on the list because I'm flagged and I was chosen by somebody. Um, and uh, this person puts me on the board, which means it's a local board. It could be throughout the city, it could be provincial, it could be countrywide, it could be global. So when everybody on the board pulls their support, then it goes global, which means that a bunch of global criminals accesses the people on the list and, um, and uh, looks at them, invade their privacy because they're targets and they have no rights, and experiment with them and keep running CDs and files about them so other people can piggyback and work on them to degrade them and destroy them and dispose of them. So in this building, there are meetings held about me, um, which is defamatory and puts my life in danger because it keeps me in the public's eyes. These comments are made publicly and uh, reports are being made to the, the police and the police accumulating a, a file about me that is depicting me as criminal based on lies. And I proved this before and this is going to go to court so I'm not going to go into too much detail. I actually made my case already. Uh, it's just a matter of getting a, a lawyer to get it done. Um, it's an open and shut case basically once all, all the, um, the background records are pulled. Um, it, there is absolutely no question that I will win. So, um, which is why um, I'm talking um, um, with, um, with a certain amount of confidence about what's going on because I want it to stop because it's putting my life in danger. Basically, it's putting my life in danger. And I, I intend to get the use of remote technology stopped for tor uh, that's used to torture and keep me in pain degrade my abilities, degrade my health, and uh, the infiltration of all my, my relationships that is um, preventing me from leading a normal life, pursuing life, liberty, and happiness, which is uh, entrenched in the constitutional code. Not only the human rights code, but uh, under constitutional law, every man, woman, and child is, an, is um, guaranteed the right to conduct their life and pursue life, liberty, and happiness. Being placed in this program um, prevents me from doing that. So these are constitutional rights abuses. Um, so these are, these are cases that uh, I, I'm actually looking for a contingency fee lawyer to take this case on because I do have really good uh, um, uh, um, backup and grounding for this case. I just need um, to, to pull the records that will, that will support the case. I just need to get the, the court records, the police records, the uh, reports that's being submitted about me, and all the um, illegal activity that's taken place and is documented, officially documented in courts, um, in, um, in um, uh, uh, I heard my name has been changed in the name registry. These things need to be pulled and investigated. Um, there is one thing that needs to be said here, and uh, there, is, um, there is an ongoing pull, a push to discourage people from helping targets. And the, uh, the, um, the, um, the threat is, if you help a target, you're going to be targeted yourself. Well, keep in mind that there are gangs out there running around with lasers and tasers. I've recorded some of the evidence of that. Um, what's stopping them from using it on anybody, just anybody? So anybody could be victimized this way. Anybody could be targets without even knowing. You don't have to... Um, to be uh, in any position, you don't have to do anything. You just can be targeted by any group of people for whatever reason they choose using these technologies. 
So um, speaking out is not going to make you a target. Right now, anybody, and, and I suspect that um, a whole lot of people are being targeted without their knowing and being used in experimentation without their realizing. Things are happening in their life that looks normal. Uh, like, like things uh, um, uh, will happen. You're going to get sick. You're going to get a cold. You're going to get a fall. You're going to get in an accident. And it's made to look like it's, um, it's uh, normal. Um, you know, it's just an accident. But really, it's not an accident when it's caused to happen. Somebody's actually targeting you. So uh, a lot of people are scared to speak out. My message here is don't be scared. Um, this is, uh, this is uh, speaking out for your human rights, basically. Because once uh, um, um, uh, this program is successful with enough people, it's going to be applied to everybody. I think that's where it's headed. So I'm just going to, um, of course, I'm getting all kinds of itches and and, and um, burning sensations on my face. So I'm just going to give you a sample, today's sample of, of um, being radiated. Being, I had a headache all day. I woke up with a headache. I woke up with earaches. And uh, this alarm was going off all night last night. And of course, it's not going off now. Surprise. It's not going off now. So um, I will uh, post, um, uh, post the videos as they, as they happen um, intermittently because I am uh, videotaping uh, right now. Um, I'm, not being, I'm not being hit. It's not going off. So uh, it's been going off all day. As soon as I turned on the camera, it, um, it stopped. So, uh, and that's my leg. That's my lower leg. And that was accompanied with a knock from the loading dock. Uh, it is my suspicion that people who use the loading dock are actually um, the participants, or some of the participants in this building, who are actually imaging me using their uh, computers, their cell phones, and it's hooked up. They can wirelessly um, trigger uh, the use of um, the electromagnetic pulse technology that is located somewhere in this, around my unit. Lasers are used as well, and sound technology is, is also used. So that was my leg, and that was the other leg. So let's see if it's turned on. There you go. In the air. So I seem to have caught the loop. I'm just going to turn it off there.